Hi, welcome to Board Shop. This is the new 2016 Hypto Crypto from Hayden Shapes. You'll be familiar with the uh, previous incarnations of this board, but now five pin setup in futures. That's what's going to be available this year um, in the UK and Europe and beyond. So, you know a bit about the Hypto, you've read about it, you've read the hype, you've seen how many awards it's won. It wins award after award after award, and there is good reason behind that. It works. It works for a huge range of people, and it works for a huge range of wave conditions. As long as you get the sizing right, um, it can work for you as well. So who's going to surf it? Someone's going to surf it looking for a one board quiver, something to handle 90% of the conditions they come across, which is thigh high to head high, basically. The hip toe in one size for you will work in that range of conditions. If you're going charging an Indo, um, you're going to want to fine tune the size. If you're only surfing slop, again, you want to go up in size a little bit to give you that extra small wave performance. So let's see why it works, how it works. Shape wise, you can see full, full volume in the nose, nice and wide surface area um, for paddling. Uh, that big surface area gives the board stability as well, as well as carrying it through flatter, fatter sections of the wave when you're actually up and riding. Flat rocker, not a huge amount of rocker there, just enough lift in the nose to stop you purling and to give the board a bit of performance in steeper or better waves. And that little bit of nose lift combined, combined with the pulled in rounded pin tail is what gives you the ability to perform in better waves whilst not sacrificing small wave performance. You can see there's a good bit of meat through the middle of the board, under the chest, so you get that paddling power. And all these features combined with the um, epoxy construction, which is light and durable, make it a really, really popular one board option. So this stringless EPS epoxy core has this uh, kind of carbon framework, and the carbon rails basically act as your, um, as your um, stringer, if you like. Now, you can see also, the profile of the rail is pretty straight. Uh, there's not a huge amount of fold out like you get with a fish type shape. Again, that's one of the features that helps to give you speed and drive and keep the board going through those poorer sections of the wave. Uh, the hip toe is just a brilliant board. It can work for a huge amount of people and everybody should have one at some stage of their surfing career to see what the hype's all about. Um, <coughs> Last little feature, single into double V out through the tail, again, helps with the drive. Um, uh, it, so much has been said about this board already, there's not a huge amount more to add, other than you can now get it in grey or nice blue tints, as well as the original white. And the five fin Futures setup does suit the board. Futures is a great fin system, uh, and we're right behind it here at Board Shop. Um, so there it is. Thank you very much for watching. And don't forget, if you've got an old board you want to trade in, you can do so against the um, hip toe. You can also pick one of these bad boys up on 0% finance and spread the pain throughout a year or so. Uh, all the details are on the website.